Here with head coach Daniel LaForce after a 59-56 win over Towson on Sunday afternoon at Solomon Corch. Coach, general thoughts? Um, a win is a win is a win. That's what they say, right? Yeah. So I guess that pertains to tonight's game. Um, you know, definitely to pull out a, a conference victory is always great. Um, I thought offensively we didn't have the best night, but we hung our hats on our defense. We forced 21 turnovers. We got you know, several steals. And uh, I think because of our defensive effort tonight, we got the win. Talk about the defensive effort. You held them from 0 for 13 from beyond the arc. Do you have a renewed focus on defending the perimeter? Well, they're not really good three-point shooters, and we knew that. That's why our zone was so effective. Um, other than McTiller and uh, Dominique Johnson, those were the only two that could hit threes. And, you know, we pressured them out on the perimeter. and didn't give them the opportunities to get any of those off. Jill Tonsil had 14 rebounds, kind of seemed like she was around the rim all game. Can you talk about her play? Yeah, she's just been great. Renewed focus on rebounding for us. Knows how important it is, especially with a small lineup. She's definitely got to be able to rebound some more, and she did that tonight. Elise Mark came out in the second half and hit three threes in a row, scored nine straight points. How about her spark in the second period? Yeah, that was the key. That really was the key in the turning point in the game, just to energize us offensively after you know a lull in, the, in our play. But um, she's capable of doing that. And when you have uh, uh, players like Deanna Kirkhoff and Kashea Cannon and even Jewel out there, you know they tend to forget about Elise, and she's a very good scorer, so I'm happy for her. Up next, you go down to Hofstra. You split with them last year, a couple of really tough games. What are you looking for going down there? Um, a, another good defensive effort. Um, we're very familiar with their offensive dribble drive, so we're going to look to defend that. Um, we just got to put some points on the, on the board, make shots, rebound, and then we should be fine. Last question, Super Sunday. Who you got, Ravens or Niners? Oh, God, who's playing? Isn't the Pats? The Pats not no in Pats. it anymore? Oh, gosh, see, I'm way behind. <laughs> All right, thanks, All right, Coach. Thanks. <laughs> Here with Senior Captain Kashea Cannon after a 59-56 victory over Towson. Super Sunday afternoon. Kashea, your general thoughts on the game? Um, overall, I didn't think we played well, but we stuck together through adversity, and we played defense, which helped us win the game. Talk about that defense. You were part of a perimeter that held Towson to 0 for 13 from beyond the arc. What did you guys do def defensively to you know, keep them from shooting the long ball? Uh, the key was pressure. We had to pressure them, um, anticipate passes, and it worked. You hit two free throws down the stretch to really ice the game after, was after missing two in a row and a couple possessions before. What was going through your head with those two more after you missed the two? I was saying to myself, I can't miss these because I just missed the ones before. So I was just trying to stay cool and make them, and I did, thank God. So. You guys go to 8-2 and two at home uh, after losing your first two of the season at home. What does it feel like to you know, get back on the winning track here at Solomon Court? feels good. We want to put on a good show for our fans. We want people to come back and watch us and show us and um, show our fans how hard we work in practice. So. All right. Thanks, Kishay.